another environmental activities lesson we are still looking at our environment and we are still looking at our toilet we have talked about the types of toilet we have talked about using the toilet properly and we are now looking at keeping our toilet clean all right children who cleans the toilet at school Oh, yeah, at school there are some people who make our environment clean. So they clean the classes, they clean the toilet, and they clean our corridors, okay? What about at home? Mommy cleans, sometimes auntie will clean, and we should also learn how to clean the toilet because we should keep the toilet clean all the time. So we should also learn or teach ourselves how to keep the toilet clean and how to clean the toilet, okay? Now, on my board here, I have someone here who is cleaning the toilet. What is he doing? He's flushing some water in the to on top of the toilet to ensure that whatever he used to clean the toilet is completely of the seat of the toilet. Can you see that? Yes. Now, uh, what do we use to clean the toilet? Who will tell us what we use to clean? Hapik. Very good. We use Hapik to clean the toilet. And you can see here on this picture, actually there is Hapik, all right? And there is a powder called what? Vim, all right? All right? Yes. There is also a piece of soap here, but it is not used to clean the toilet. It is used for washing our hands after we have finished using the toilet, okay? Yes. Now, what, do, what else do we use to clean the toilet? In the toilet that is being cleaned here, we have to use a toilet brush. What do we use again? A toilet brush, because we have to scrub all the dirt inside so that it can be clean all right and then we use also what toilet powder it depends on what you have you can have a toilet powder you can have vim you can have harpic to put in the toilet and then use the brush to scrub everything off and then rinse the way this man is doing here all right we also have a lady here, as you can see. This is another type of a toilet. And what do you think she is using? As you can see on the floor, she used a powder or she used Vim. She put it on the floor here and then leave it for some time so that the germs can die. And then she will come with a broom and sweep and scrub all the dirt from the floor and then with a bucket of water here she will pour it here to clean or to flush all this inside the pit she does not leave it on top here okay children all right why do we have to use these items to clean the toilet the harpic the vim the toilet powder the toilet cleaner why do we have to use them why do we have to use them? Very good. Someone says that they help to kill the germs in the toilet. And that is very true. There is a lot of germs in the toilet because as you can see, we use the toilet to relieve ourselves or to do a health routine. So sometimes there may be flies that come in in the toilet so they make the toilet place to be uh, dirty or to be infested with germs that is why we have to use these cleaning agents 
that help to kill bacteria in the toilet and in the floors of the toilet like this one here. Okay, children? And with this agent, like for the Vim, we can also use it to clean the walls of the toilet so that they can also remain clean. And these agents, they also have a good smell. When we use them to clean the toilet, there will be good smell. It will not be smelling bad. So you will not be hating the next time that you're going to the toilet. Okay, children? Yes, when the toilet is kept clean, we will always want to go to the toilet. Okay, children? Yes. So, our toilet should be clean. We should use these things, the toilet brush, toilet powder, toilet cleaner, which can be Harpic. Powder can be Vim, okay? And we use them to kill germs in the toilet and then have that fresh smell in the toilet. Okay, so we will always want to go there because the toilet is clean. Would you want to go to a dirty toilet? No, people don't like to go into dirty, smelly toilets. And what about when it is in the house? It is also very, it will smell very bad and it will be very bad because when it is dirty and it is in the house, the flies can carry germs from the toilet and take them to the kitchen where our food is being prepared. And what will happen? The flies will touch our food and leave our germs there. Then what will happen? When we eat our food, we'll have a running and a paining stomach, okay? And then we have to go to the doctor. Would we want that? No. So what should we do? Keep our toilets clean. Wherever they are in the compound, whether outside for the pit latrine, all inside for the bowl toilet we should keep them always clean okay children yes now i have a picture here in this wonderful book here for pre-primary one you can see this lady cleaning the toilet here maybe when auntie is cleaning the toilet you can also go there and see the way she's doing it or mommy cleaning the toilet okay you can also tell mommy to show you how to clean the toilet depending on the type of toilet that you have at home okay children and then on page number 62 of this book we have a soap here toilet powder washing agent and toilet cleaner and you can color this these pictures here as you discuss them with your parents at home and how they are used and why they are used Okay, children? Yes, color them and show your parents. And then we will ensure that our toilets are clean. Make sure your toilet is clean. Okay, children? Very well. I know you are good children and you are going to keep our toilets clean, use them properly so that we keep the family healthy. Okay, children? Thank you very much. See you in the next lesson. Bye.